Hello and welcome back. Paint job? Easy, I guess, I think. But this engine actually turned out to be one of my worst nightmares until now. What's why? I want to loosen the screws before I will paint it. And they are pretty stuck when I uh, try to, uh, to take them out. So I will heat it up and try to get them out. Oh my god, not again. I fucking break the bolt. I heated it up, I feel that it was loose, but it broke anyway. Oh, I hate this. That is fucked up. So the outboard is upside down. I make sure that there was no water in the lake, so it had been sitting for a few days and I blow some air into it and there was no water. So I don't hope there is any water in it because then it can run into the motor. One thing I forgot is actually to em empty the carburetor before I did this. So it's smelling like gas in here right now. But let's hope I have um, put some uh, oil into it it is some Jamaica oil. It should be so good for this. I have never used it, never heard about it, but uh, a guy told me about it. The guy I actually bought this engine from and he gave me a little bit. I actually forgot the last screw in here, but still I cannot get it off. I was slamming here with a piece of wood and then I hit this one, it broke off. It's also broke off here because I took my piece of wood in here, smashed it up here and it broke off. So believe me, I'm so pissed off of this engine right now. It's, I hate it because it's a waste of money. It was not the, it was not expensive. It was not cheap, but still now I just have a bunch of shit that I need to, that I, that I actually wanted to sail with. I wanted to paint it and make it beautiful and everything. And now it's just a piece of shit. So here it won't give a millimeter at all. So I assume it is the drive shaft that is stuck. So there is some, uh, some small holes here. And, uh, and there's also some other holes that I can spray a lot of, uh, Something I will not say into it. Hope that I can hit the uh, drive shaft so it can run down to the engine. And in the engine, it's stuck down there. I assume it is the problem. Okay. I maybe got a new great idea. I cannot smash this one off. So uh, I think I will unscrew those here and take the whole leg off. I already unscrewed those. <laughs> look on all that corrosion i just tested all of them here and uh, i could turn them a little bit and i could hear this click so it it seems like i can get it off so i can actually get a whole leg off and maybe we can put something down here and bash the uh, lower unit off so i unscrewed those six screws here one of them snapped but the other one didn't I also unscrewed these two here. I put the um, the bowl in here and the bowl on the other side just to make sure when I raise it up it will not uh, fall on me or get apart that easily or something like that. So let's just uh, put it down, get it up, see if we can get the leg off. Oops. I love working with outboards, but this one turned into a nightmare. I hate it right now. I do not know what to do. 
and I will put it to the side because right now if if I'm going to work on it right now I'll just smash it up like hell and I will not do that so put it to the side and um, yeah I got one idea left it's actually put it to my boat trailer and uh, hook it up there but I cannot do that by myself because it's pretty heavy so um, there will come a part two of this video if I will work on the engine again but for now I'll put it to the side so uh, sail safe oh. I do not sail anything with this one.